Thank you very much. It's great to be here. I'm Jane Lynch, and welcome to Hollywood Game Night. You laugh, but I actually had somebody say to me, has anybody ever told you that you look like the actress Jane Lynch? I said, no, just you. Everybody else has been polite enough to just think it. But for some reason, you seem to think that telling a middle-aged man that he looks like a middle-aged woman is an icebreaker. <laughs> Why don't you really get on my good side and tell me which Teletubby I sound like? <laughs> and don't you dare say Tinky Winky. <laughs> To clarify, my name is Jeff, and for those of you sitting in the back of the room, I'm a man. <laughs> Hashtag, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> my doctor told me I have low testosterone. I said, how low? He said, you can start shopping at Ann Taylor. <laughs> One night, a woman my age approached me after a show and said, you got something against being a woman? I said, no, ma'am. In fact, I'd like to go through menopause just to see if it'll make my voice as deep as yours. <laughs> Here's a question I get a lot. Hey, Jeff, that's not your real voice, is it? Oh, no, of course not. My real voice makes me sound like a woman, so I use this manly one instead. <laughs> yeah, if I were using my real voice, you'd be thinking, hey, look, Ellen really let herself go. <laughs> one time, somebody actually asked me if I were a woman who had surgery to become a man. I said, no, but if I were, I'd ask for my money back. <laughs> what woman wants to pay to become a man who's less manly than the woman she used to be? <laughs> the upside is whenever I need to go to the bathroom really bad, I can use any restroom I want. <laughs> Another cool thing about my voice, if I ever go into politics, this voice will protect me from political scandals. <laughs> I did not have romantic relations with that woman. <laughs> oh, don't worry, we believe you. <laughs> Although I'm not a manly man, I'm not a girly man either. I'm right in the middle. I'm what you might call a manly girly man. Whenever one of my manly man friends says, hey, Jeff, you want to go to Cabela's and check out the shotguns and crossbows? I'm like, you know it, bro. As long as we can stop at the Yankee Candle store on the way home. <laughs> Whenever one of my manly man friends says, hey, Jeff, do you like the Miami Dolphins? I'm like, you know it, bro, for two reasons. One, Larry Zonka and Dan Marino are two of the baddest hombres to ever play the game. And two, I've always enjoyed the combination of orange and aquamarine. <laughs> Sometimes manly man thoughts and girly man thoughts play tug of war in my head. <laughs> this guy's a jerk. I should knock his block off. But what if I break my hand? I can't scrapbook wearing a cast. Hey, did you know that Dry Bar Comedy has its own app? Download it right now to watch, save, and share clips and watch my entire special.